British homes have worst in Europe. British homes have worst in Europe energy efficiency. If you compare with Netherlands, Germany or Austria, when the winters are very harsh, comparing to British, where we take a benefit from Gulf Storm, well, losing three degrees during five hours is a huge waste of energy. And I'm saying that because we just heard that actually we can save half of the money we're supposed to give to energy companies to lower energy prices in UK, to cap energy prices to 2500 BBC said that if the uh, gas prices will stay as they are right now, we will save up to 60 billion. So from 130 billion, we will save 60 billion, half of it. And this is related to this chart. The Bliss Trust program was planned for, let's say, worst scenario where gas prices per term will be about 464p. And analysts and said, and BBC is, well, quite confident to repeat it, that the prices, if the prices will stay at the current level, about 365, and taking historically after spike, we usually have a long plateau. Uh, it means that we could save up to 60 billion if the prices stay here. And actually, this phenomenon was already uh, spotted much more before Liz Truss introduced her program in end of August, when, for example, EU started introducing day programs. So what we have can do with 60 billions? Well, let's say insulate 4 million houses, 4 million homes. Uh, it's a quite important because, uh, as I said, British homes badly need insulations. They are worst energy. They have a worst energy efficiency. So 4 billion, 4 million houses from 60 billions, and that's taking a top esteem from the insulation uh, job range. This is actually from the job price website. I find in my personal light quite helpful doing a little uh, jobs at home or garden. So they say you need about eight grand to 15 grand to insulate semi detached house. And but five to seven if you just want to put plasters and so on. So that's a low range and this is higher range of insulation. So yeah, we badly need insulation because as we see British homes are energy inefficient. And that would give us potentially huge energy savings. This is conservative estimates from EDF, those guys who sell us energy. And they say, well, dude, if you insulate your home, you will have between six, 600 or 1,060 pounds um, insulation savings over the year. And this is conservative taking under consideration that guys who work in the business so you can save up to 20%, 25%. So remember that for the next two years, our energy, uh, our energy electricity prices will be capped at 2,500. So 20% from that is at least 500. So it's quite conservative esteem. But even the very hawkish express quote experts saying that you could actually save up to 2000 a year 2200 a year even if you simply insulate your home and do extra jobs like this one drought proofing roof insulation if you do wall insulation put cavity and so on if you invest in new boiler and those guys were very hawkish and went very badly with insulate britain activities activists and says said that that's a bullshit so yeah i say again as i said before on this channel insulate britain wasn't wrong they were right and we need to push the agenda uh, because well during a Boris Johnson 
Boris Johnson government, it was announced that potentially they will introduce one billion program to insulate homes, which could give much less results. It will be one sixties of this. Uh, that's about 60,000 homes to be insulated, comparing to 4 millions if we could use the 60 billions. So, and which is worse, we don't hear from Liz Truss any announcement to, in, to, pull, to start insulating our houses. So actually we hear opposite actions. She's going to scrap green energy, green levy, sorry. She talks about scrapping green energy. Um, I mean, she doesn't want to see, I don't know, solar or wind farms because they are very depressing for her. And when I'm said green levies, I should mention that they are the main source of income for the insulation programs. Um, so scrapping green levies actually undermine potential insulation, insulation programs in the UK. So we should push, push agenda about insulation. We should put agenda, a uh, press, press agenda of uh, use the saved money to insulate homes. Even if there won't be 60 million, 60 billions, at least we can save some, some energy, be a little bit more, uh, well, work a little bit more to save our climate, uh, to protect our um, households and to save some energy and save money for many, many people. That's my couple of thoughts. Thanks to Lo Robert, Max Robespierre for sharing his clip on his video. And yeah, catch up soon.